Hey everybody, hope you're having a good day. Great weather here. It's uh, time to start hitting our mineral spots for the year. Normally what we'll do those, I run these all year. We don't hunt over them. Uh, it's illegal here, of course. But um, anyhow, run these all year. Usually do half a bucket per month on them. But um, this time of year, as soon as everything starts greening up, I like to use a full bucket at each site and um, just to get things freshened up, ready to go. You know, the ground's changing and stuff now, getting warmer and everything. So we're going to get these put out. we got three spots to do today. That's how many we have here. And um, the deer crush these things. The does love them. It's good for them. Um, the bucks, we've noticed a difference in uh, antler growth. Um, definitely put on some size, but their mass is what the biggest thing is that we've seen change over the last five or six years that we've been doing this consistently. Um, but yeah, we're going to get these dumped out here and enjoy the rest of the day. So we'll see you at the next spots. that easy. Uh, now you got to do is wait for it to rain a little bit. Let it all seep in the ground. You can work the ground up a little bit if you want to with a rake or shovel or something. But um, the deer are using this. They know it's here. So we're good to go. On to the next one. Spot number two. Help, nope, spot number three now. Pretty much done. Hope uh, everybody else is planning for their deer already and out getting some springtime stuff done. We're already looking forward to deer season this fall. Look forward to it every year and get excited for it. So, whatever everybody else is doing, let us know. Uh, put it down in the comments, do a little bit of talking, and, uh... Well, it's been about three weeks or a month, I forget now, since I freshened these up for the first time of the year. But, uh, you can tell the deer are just crushing it already. So I'll get, uh, some video of the other ones, too. I'm gonna go ahead and start doing half a bucket now, once a month for the year, so... We'll see the other ones here in a minute. Well, they're sort of working this one over pretty hard too. Gonna get some more in it, freshen it up for the month. And uh, next month or so we'll be getting some cameras up on them. Let's see what we got. Looks like this might be the busiest one so far. They've got it all torn up. Can't wait to get some cameras up this year. It's always an exciting time seeing what you got growing. Getting stuff planted here these few days and it's time to sit and wait pretty much for a little while anyhow. So I'll see you guys. We're out doing the minerals again. It's June now. Let's say the deer are using them pretty heavily. Which they usually do every year. Try to get a bigger view of it. This is just all tore up from the deer. All these spots I haven't been here for, I don't know, four or five years now. So this isn't just this year. But um, they do work them pretty hard. So we'll get the other two. And this one here is seeing a bunch of action too. So while we're out refreshing them. And do it. 
supposed to get some rain this evening, so right ahead of rain is a good time to do it. So all leeches into the ground. Definitely getting tore up. Got the trails coming in. Got one down through here. One down that way. One over this way. Probably one up past the quad there too, I think. Here's the last one. Getting at this one pretty good too. Got more trails. You can see that one down through there. Uh, they always come in through that way. Got one out right up through there. I believe one. Yeah, one right down through there. I love these things. Definitely good for them. We'll have pictures of lots of fawns and stuff at them too. Once they get just a little bit bigger, we've been seeing a few already. And I actually saw a real nice buck just a little bit ago while I was redoing these. So, hopefully, if you guys got these out already, you're replenishing them. And if you don't have any, you ought to try them. And I know some states are allowed to hunt over them. We're not here in Pennsylvania, so you won't see us hunting over these. But, uh,. We'll uh, have some more stuff coming up here and we'll talk to you guys later on. Have a good one.